So we're here today um, at the dollar store. Um, you might not think this is a good place for design, right? <laughs> I know, think about it. So this, this, people say, oh, don't ever get things from dollar store. It's so cheap. It's so, you know, you know, like, right? they don't last. But think about it. How can they make products like this so cheap that you can buy it for a dollar? Well, <laughs> you, look it, the, yeah. you look at it. You see, this this piece, you learn so much from just looking at how it's made. This is punched out of a piece of um, sheet metal. How see? do you know? For sure, because they're all the same thickness. And then it's and um, it's definitely punched because... But how is it like bent? In this it's bent by shape? a press. So then there's a top press coming down on, a, on the metal and the bottom pushing up. And it formed this curve. And look, it has, it has structure. You see, it doesn't bend because... Because they make this ridge so that it um, has some strength, right? So, okay, this is one example. So now, come over here, come over here, come over here. Look at all these. So, they can easily make a billion of these things, and it could be really cheap because it's just punch and press. So, let's look at look, look over here. This is different. This is injection molding. This, this is injection molding, okay? Mega injection molding. It means. Um, they squish, they squeeze metal from, let me see, maybe I'm wrong. They, they um, injected like hot plastic, plastic into, into a mold. Yeah, into a mold. And then they popped After it After it cools yep, down, they And then sanded it. You see it here? They sanded the corners oh, where it's connected. But still, it's...